Today's food for thought comes from Deuteronomy, the eighth chapter, verses 18 and 19, which reads, And you shall remember the Lord your God, for it is he who gives you power to get wealth, that he may establish his covenant which he swore to your fathers, as it is this day. Then it shall be, if you by any means forget the Lord your God, and follow other gods, and serve them and worship them, I testify against you this day, that you shall surely perish. Remember the Lord your God are words that I would suggest to you should be preached often. They should be preached often because of how often all of us seemingly forget all that God has done for us. Each and every day, I want you to understand, is another blessing. It is another blessing from the Lord because it is another opportunity for all of us to be able to set out and accomplish all of our desires, all of our dreams, and all of our goals. God, he has given to all of us the ability to go out and to do as we desire. The Lord, he supplies our every need and he continues to make a way for us each and every day. Yet, look at what we do in return. Many of us, we have become proud boasters of the things that we have done, as if all that we have accomplished in our life, all that we have gained in our life was solely by our own strength, by our own power, by our own might. Quite frankly, I say to you today that it is truly sad just how many of us are so unthankful for all that God has done for us and that he continues to pour his blessings out onto us. Now, again, some of us may ask, well, what blessings has the Lord poured out onto me? Along with what I've already shared with you today, I want you to understand that the Lord, when we are beat down in our soul, he gives life to our soul. With the Lord, there is rest for the weary, yet we often overlook all that God does for us. Now, choosing not to remember, I want you to understand today that that is a selfish and that is a terrible decision for one to make. So I encourage you, not just because it is Thanksgiving, but because this should happen all the time. Remember the Lord and all that he has done for you. When you remember the Lord, he will continue to pour out his love. He will continue to pour out his blessings onto you. However, when you choose to forget the Lord, just know there will be a day where he will say that he does not know who you are. I hope my thought for today has given you something to think about, and I hope that it will encourage you, that it will uplift you, and that it will motivate you as well. Be sure that you share this thought with someone somewhere, and if you haven't already done so, make sure that you're following this channel so that you can always receive my next Food for Thought.